going over the torque gusset traction bar. Uh, I have several applications for this, uh, this particular product. Um, there's the Fiesta ST, the Focus ST, Focus RS, Mazda Speed 3 Gen 2, as well as the Volkswagen GTI and Golf R. Uh, I'm going to go over how this uh, works. Basically, we have four points of contact. These two points up here are going to be horizontal on the chassis. They're going to intersect with the LCAs and they're going to prevent changes in tow um, and alignment that occur under hard acceleration or hard cornering. Basically, the, the uh, pickup points will start to shift a little bit under hard acceleration, and this brace is preventing that. But with the torque gusset, you also get the bonus of these two rear pickup points. These tie into the bushings on the back of the LCA. Um, this prevents bushing deflection under hard acceleration as well as cornering, um, and basically prevents those bushings from shifting around and causing changes in tow and alignment. Uh, this, these changes in tow uh, in particular, but as well as uh, some uh, changes in, um, in caster, uh, cause the, the car to have wheel hop and torque steer. Um, so by locking these two different points down, you're reducing two of the main reasons for torque start, steer and wheel hop uh, on front wheel drive or front wheel drive bias, all wheel drive such as the Golf R and uh, Focus RS. Uh, the entire uh, piece is constructed of uh, tube steel. Uh, it's very thin gauge tube steel that's used on its edge. Uh, this allows the product to be extremely light as well as very strong and rugged. Um, a lot of the aluminum braces that I've seen from competitors tend to end up with the cups being deformed after some road debris hits it or something like that, um, which makes the brace completely, you know, having to be ground off the car with a, a grinder. Um, and it obviously destroys the product in the process. The steel that I use prevents that from ever happening. I use uh, so basically double thickness uh, end cups that are also made of steel. Um, they're a billet uh, alloy of steel, and this prevents the, uh, the cups themselves from deflecting under load, as well as giving it more rigidity and, um, and ruggedness for anything that could happen on the roadway. Um, I like to build my parts so that it's not just a you know, uh, pure track thing. This is something that helps protect oil pans um, it helps save the undercarriage of your car from road debris and, and, uh, and various other things. So think of it like a combination of a skid plate, a chassis brace, and you know, just a pretty badass overall looking product. So if you guys have any questions, feel free to hit me up. I hope this video kind of shows and explains the process of producing one of these, as well as the overall function and form of these products. All right, guys, just to close out, I'm going to leave you guys with a time lapse of me producing five different torque gussets. Uh, that way you guys can be along for the ride without having to sit there for about, you know, four hours in the garage. Um, anyway, uh, make sure you guys like and subscribe so that you guys can see the new content that's coming out every day. Uh, we're releasing stuff as soon as we can. Uh, also, there's a link for the products inside the description of this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it and take it easy.